talk me through uh, playing slots for somebody who doesn't know anything about it. I think um, you have to set yourself a limit, and uh, so you don't get addicted to it. You don't go beyond that limit. Like you set a certain amount each day, and you go and, and you today, just play. You can play a minimum bet or a maximum bet. In different places, I think because of the more people that are retired that are playing, I think your minimum bet is the best because um, they don't pay a lot of money. They're there for the enjoyment and the time. The lower you play, the longer you can play. I think that's what yeah, I, that most people find. But we, um, but you have to go with the understanding that it's fun it's, and it's straight entertainment. Like we find it great entertainment for the amount of hours. You can play the same amount. Say you're paying a hundred dollars for the for the evening or something like that. Or, and uh, you know, a hundred dollars take you to a movie, and you're there for less time than you are in a casino. Now, what's your daily limit today, and how long can you play? I would, on I, that? Well, we're only here for the day, and so we, uh, each of us decide on two hundred each. So I've already played about 80 now, and I'll go have supper, and then I'll play 100 after supper. Okay, and, and you know, and if I do, if I make money, you're, if you make money on your 200, your 100 dollars, you're playing six hours on 100 dollars. That's that's great entertainment. And how, how often do you win? Do you think? Uh, we. Uh, I haven't won the last two times, but uh, my husband won big just the last time we, were, we went to Quebec City and uh, to a casino there two weeks ago, and he won big there, and my daughter won before that, so it's my turn to win. But I've won most of the, most of the time I go, I win. Can, can you just show me what you physically do here? What you physically do is you put in, you put in money into the slot machine here, and what happens, there's no money exchanging anymore. It used to be where you used to have, when you used to go to Vegas, you used to have your quarters, nickel, and, and dimes and your dollars coming out in your in buckets. They don't do it. It's all paper cash now. Paper transfer. So you just if you have a piece of paper that comes out, you can cash it out. But you just go and you play in. I'm playing a bet for a dollar twenty. So I'm just hitting this one here a bet for a dollar twenty. And whatever happens, happens. Do I get a bonus? I might hit. No, it didn't hit anything. So and I can drop the bet or I can increase the bet. I'll drop the bet. So it's so, see and all this I bet I bet 80 and I'm winning uh, right now I'm winning probably a dollar dollar thirty. So I made money just on that. Just and, on. and it all goes on your uh, card or? No, I didn't bring a card here because we haven't been here before. But we do have cards for other places. Too. So what keeps track of your profit on that play? It's you, all in the you, machine? You do. And you keep track of this is the amount of money that you put in. It goes by dollar, or if you hit it, it goes by credits. Okay. You can hit it for dollars. So it's and like like uh, putting money in a copying machine yeah, sure and how much you have left. Yeah, yeah, and how much you have left. You get down to zero. You get down to ten and you, you find when the machine's not making money, then you just cash out and you get a ticket from here. Okay. You take your ticket and then you can put it into another machine. And you start off just putting in a $20 bill sure, or whatever? You can put in $20, you can put in 5 Put in whatever you want. Why, why, do you, why do you love slots? I just, I guess it's idiot work. I don't know why I love slots. <laughs> Entertains me. You can come and uh, not worry about anything, you know? And I'm done. <laughs>